Who's in next? Now you can toss in the rice. Rice is in. Okay, now this has to bubble and brew. Patio? Grab a chair. And a beer or something else. It's nice out here. Yeah. Seems all good. Like nothing bad ever happened. Tell me now about Harris. I paid him a visit at the hospital. He's still in a coma? Yep. In a strange slumber between life and death. An empty shell in a hospital bed. One shot to the head. Quick and clean. I had the same thought. It would be so easy. I pressed the gun to his head and remembered something. River? How my parents died. Now, oh, I'm sure you want to hear this. You know, probably not the best time now. We were gonna do the nice, relaxing thing. Huh. Sounds heavy, this. Okay, yeah. You're probably right. Just... Harris. What did you do? Had the gun to his head, and... I've ended a few lives in my time. But never like that. Never an execution. Slipped out of the hospital quick. Told myself the case was closed. That's good. But what now? You're not... Going back to the PD. P.I. has a nice ring to it. Who knows? Uncle River, we'll you said you'd play with us. You promised. All right, all right. Let's go. Me? Join us? What are we gonna play, Uncle River? You'll see. Dorian, we're playing! Yeah, big trouble in Haywood. Grab your set. I always wanted to try a game like this. Well, well. Nice firepower there. This is no time to get distracted. We can't let that filth get away. Who? Oh, well, look at you. V, allow me to introduce Captain Joan McLean and Lieutenant Henry Callahan. They're our precinct's best and brightest. Wouldn't want to get in their way. I always work alone. No exceptions. Even for you. Yeah! Me too! Ooh, I've heard of cops like you. The lone wolf type. That's right. Thorns in their commander's side. Rebels who play by their own rules. I've been suspended one time, retired two times, and kicked off the force three times. I'm getting too old for this. But something always drags you back. The city needs me. All right, let's get to it. Right. All we gotta do is track down El Chamuco in Diablado and take out his lackeys along the way. He'll pay for his crimes. We'll play like two teams, us and the kids, but we work toward the same objective. 
The team with the best result wins. You don't stand a chance. Hey, v, just go easy, okay? It's their favorite game. Sure. Get him! The city's mine! You'll never take her from me! <laughs> He's fast, but not fast enough to escape justice! Watch out! Not half bad! He's hit! He's hit! Is that all you got? Not half bad! Nuh-uh! Watch this! Next round! Next round! This way! It must be their rat-infested hideouts! I could smell the moral decay from a mile off. Mm, quiet. Too quiet. It's a trap! They were waiting for us! is ready. On the table. So, was your game fun? Awesome! <laughs> we kicked their big butts! The bad guys? Huh? Oh, yeah, the bad guys, too! Time to see if this tastes as good as it smells. Unemployment's being good to you. You seem good. River's discovering the joys of family life. That and police duty. Never a good mix. This here's a way to get some of those years back. I haven't seen him this... untroubled in a while. What about you, V? You got a family? Or just relations? Used to be a nomad, but the family fell apart. Years ago, feels like. Nothing's more important to me than my kids. I've made mistakes. Life's gone off the rails sometimes. But I had my kids. I got my kids.
Speaking of, be great if Randy was here. Won't be long. Randy loves Jambalaya. Joss, you see me being a parent ever? I mean, I don't exactly look like good palm material myself, so... Yes! Who says yes? Well, that's decided. <laughs> Got an 11.99. Officer needs backup. Come on, pull you out of this ambush. Thanks, Joss. Yeah, thanks. Whew. Situation was getting dicey. That's what partners are for. You were about a hair's breadth away from having to look at photo albums. Here we are. What are we looking at? A water tower. Great spot. Great for what? Having a drink? Shooting the shit. This way I... Oh, fuck. Gate stuck again. Gonna fix it one of these days. Let me give you a boost. Climb over, open it from the other side. No need. Whoa! Okay, we like leaping. Ugh. Okay! On our way. Area's not bad, actually. Unlikely to dazzle. Make a good first impression, though. Certainly no Corpo Plaza. No. But life's livable here. No worse places to raise kids. Randy's problems with the law. Those didn't pop out of thin air. True. But Randy takes after his old man. He'd find trouble in a nicer neighborhood, too. Apparently the worst city between the Atlantic and the Pacific. But I sure do love this view. Find it calming. Yeah, I like where we are now. Right here. Outside looking in. Away from all the urban chaos. It reminds me a bit of home. Got something for you. Wow. What's the occasion? Aiming to close the door. A stage of my life is done. This thing holds too many memories. Won't let me do that. It'll serve you better. Thank you. Just promise you won't blow your foot off. Oddly specific request. Josh's husband did it. Drunk. This very spot. Which made this your special spot. Family landmark? Something of the kind. Now for the highlight of the evening. Up for a drink? Something strong sure to hit the spot. Now that I understand. Here's to Joss and the kids. Yeah, to family. You got any more of that? Two bottles of whiskey and a case of beer ought to be enough. <laughs> we'll see about that. Buckle your liver in. Gonna be a long night and a longer morning.
Now where'd I put that? of the moon and there's still no cure for hangovers well at least we had fun yesterday yeah um, but now i gotta roll promised joss i'd take her to see randy no rush either get your sea legs back take as much time as you need sure you're good to drive <laughs> please former ncpd <clears throat> i'm a pro on hangover highway be fine. Apologize to Joss for me. We kinda dined and dashed yesterday. And left puke all over the bathroom? Aw, oh, shit. Tell Randy, hey. Will do. See you later, V. Yeah, Looking for a change. Slept pretty good. Still had to get up early because I got the.
Best prices in Dogtown. Certified resale. Man, fuck the coolers. Shop local. Shop with Ronald Ronnie the Roster. Tad Caliente. Guy clearly went down with this place. Stash house by the looks of it. Right. Interesting. Antique. Junkie variety. Wonder if it even works. I'll have a double cheeseburg while you're at it. Reed? Listen. Got no time to play games. Hello? Fossil's probably busted. Or you flopped the number. What the fuck do we do now? Who is this? 
Call me V. Andrew Jackson, basketball court. Daytime. Noted. Not exactly loquacious, our man of mystery. Could just prefer text. Damn sure I do. Ain't nothing without your help. Check out Ronald's Cream Stems. What do you need, boss? How's biz? Eddie's flowing. Nah, Chum. Delta Crash got everyone scarcity. Half a dog town's chasing Rosalind Myers like bitches in heat. Shit's fake news. Tomorrow's another day. Peeps know Ronald's shop always got what they need. Look like a chum has been around D-Town. Around? Shit, player. This is my home turf. Who'd you think I am? You talking to the Pacifica Typhoon, Chum? A.K.A. the DT Prodigy. Yeah, okay, that one ain't my fave. But... Uh, when they was pumping me with boosters, could blast 100 meters in 6.0. Yeah, you heard right. Now I ain't do hardly 100 a day, no more. But what I'm saying is, hell yeah, I've been around. Typhoon Ronnie, huh? You serious? Scan the old screamers if you were doubt. Old Ronnie was a legend in the making. Huh. How'd your uh, rising star suddenly flop? Well, there's this chick, Fiona. It had this um center for gifted youth and shit. Future sports stars. All good, right? We, we talking a uh, roof overhead, real food, training. Boosters and chrome, heaps of chrome, Chum. Shit was all rainbows and roses till you stumbled. And Chum, I fucking wiped out. Landed in the D-Town street with mean-ass migraines and insomnia. And I was lucky, too. D-Town's districts, what do you know? Huh, which ones, my man? Golden Pacific be in the north of D-Town. I got this hill there, Luxor Heights. Name makes a promise and delivers. Prem views, 10 out of 10. Longshore Stacks is the west side. Place got history, feel me? Uh, south is Terra Cognita. You best stay the fuck clear of there. Okay, Longshore Stacks. What do you know? Hmm. Everything there is pre-Unity War shit. Get me? Start seeing containers means you found a place. Them containers? They used to hold bricks and beams for building the hood. Shit got clapped, Avi. But them big-ass boxes ain't going nowhere. Now, we D-Towners, we resourceful. Some clever tunes grabbed them and behold, prime living space in high-rises, no less. Ain't no shit go to waste here, you know? Looks or heights? Know anything about them? Hey, best not snoop round there. Them voodoo boys been doing voodoo shit since they made it their crib. Now they hop between two beds, Scavs and Hansons. For your visit, it's good to know who they be fucking round with at the time. Ask him for trouble otherwise.
Golden Pacific. Grandiose name, am I right? Shit, Choom. Suits promise Eddie's raining down from every window. Peep shit in solid gold. Prove true enough for my man Hanson. He the only one making fat stacks in that place, huh? Golden Pacific's a bar gas breeding ground. Got their beers, logistics, fun times. All in one hell of a dangerous place if you was not one of them dogs. Gotta say, first time in the hood. So, Tara, got any travel tips? As I say, steer the fuck clear of Terra Cognita. Hm. The place was a fucking Quan's paradise years back. Talking space flight, chrome of the future, all sorts of tech. Shit'll fry your skull sponge. Now, nothing but dirt and dust and scabs. Red ass motherfuckers running the place. You go to Terra Cognita? You a corpse incognita. <laughs> you get it? Incognita. <laughs> Since we're already talking. Yeah, yeah, well, what you think? Got some pretty unique places around here. This hood just exuding clever now, ain't it? <laughs> Been to the stadium. Quite a sight. Uh-huh. They had big plans to set up shop there, you know? But whoa! The competition whooped my typhoon ass. You know, Nighthawks was roosting there while Hanson was still shitting his diapers. How's it go? Good times make bad tunes, then bad tunes fuck shit up? Bottom line is all about the Eddies. Who got the most scratch? Hanson. Stadium ain't his main biz, oh no, but I ain't gonna say no more on that, huh? Came through this kind of expo hall. Some curious mock-ups of all kinds of buildings here. Oh, you got guts, man. Like what you saw? Them suits must have been tripping balls coming up with them district plans. <laughs> and then wham! Reality kicked in. Gongs probably woke up face down in the streets thinking, where did it all go wrong? Expo ain't no place for civvies. You got pre-war goods and shit there. Best stay clear, especially since Pete's been hearing blasts and explosions. No thank you. Even got a pyramid. Hard to miss that one. Pretty prim, hmm? Fixes things up for sure. Beers talks get drowned out by wild party hubbub and tracks that are fire. Privacy guaranteed, hmm? Bottoms open to all the riffraff. Upper levels, though? Shit's for VIPs. Big players. Big biz. Feel me? Maybe go and visit myself. <laughs> Banging tunes. Dent slides of Snow White. And the biz is in tune. That's how you get in the major leagues. Big skyscraper. Know anything about it? Suits called it the Black Sapphire way back when. Folks call it the Hotel or Tower these days. Place is gilded, I hear. Pretty much out of reach for us mortals. Apple of eye, his golden egg. He wanna make tunes with you. He gonna invite you there. He had a view from the top is motherfucking Nova. Might be a little crazy, but I ain't cray cray enough to find out for myself. Since we're already talking. Yeah, yeah, well, what you thinking? Thanks. Real helpful. Seem to really know your way around. Well, shit. In my line of work, it's all about the gossip. The juicier, the better. But send some real spicy ones your way if you're so inclined. You know what? Fuck it, why not? Be nice to know what the street's saying. Yeah, starting to get me now, huh? Gotta get a leg up whatever way you can in good old D-Town. Stay in touch, Chum. Let's see what you got. 
supremest shit you ever seen.
Jaden for the next gig. Why him? He a weak ass pussy. Yeah, but he's kind of hot. But no, the thing is, he got some real supplements in Ronnie. Ronnie? Shit. Say. Goodbye to their pretty face. Best seats in the house. A piece of the plane smashed into our kitchen. You believe it's Gonna be that? a game to remember. Johnny Silverhand. Everybody Basketball there. fan? Yes, and you? You know what I mean. He always said we another game another started. Window. One where your head's the fucking ball. Felt the same thing. Something nasty's brewing. Fucking storm's what's brewing. Don't let the sunshine fool you. You're up against seasoned players, whereas you just stumbled onto the court. These are trained sociopaths. Pretend to be your friends while they fucking ain't. So go out and play. Just don't get played. Metaphor getting through or not? Just come out and say it. You don't trust Myers. No, her type is all. Politicians? Worse. Armed forces. Saying no to high-ranking cunts like putting your mouth over the barrel of their gun. Get shitty fast if you try to run. Take it from a deserter. <laughs> No offense, but can we just chill a sec, watch the game some, enjoy just that? Why not? How about a hot dog and a cold beer while we're at it? Pretend we don't got a worry in the world. That would be so nice. Well, when you put it like that, fine. Savor it while it lasts. Don't turn around. Eyes on the court. Ah. Uh. Would you hold her? Johnny? Who the hell's breathing down my neck? How the fuck should I know? Only see what you see. I see you holding something. Show me. I'd like to know who I'm talking oh, to. My, Mitchell. You know who I am. Now, hands, show me. Got this token. Mean anything to you? <gasps> I need to make sure. Keeps his cards close, this one. Who sent you? Don't know you. Don't work for you. So you can fuck off with the interrogation bullshit. Interrogation? We're just talking. Keep it cool, P. Let me ask you again. Who sent you? Mutual friend. We don't have mutual friends. Friend survived an accident. You might have heard. I might have. Zone defense, that. Keep pushing. Is she safe? Hard to say. The longer we sit here. That's it. Dribble around him. Were you followed? Did you even bother to check? <laughs> Take me for a fucking gonk? An amateur? You sure fooled me. But fine. That I have to do. Black Thornton Merrimack, on the street. Three minutes. Front seat. That it? Interrogation over? Already? We're starting to have fun. Read. Slippery motherfucker. I think we really hit it off. Sure. Bet he's got candy in that van. Ready to find out? Hey. You see the guy I was talking to a millisecond ago? Big guy? Coke looking like he's planning on flashing some kids, huh? Hey! Shut it or get lost! We 
with the right cams installed, man, a free full dunk ain't even hard. Blackthorn. Before we go, apologies for the precautions. I only ever rest so much. Sometimes it's just safer to shove the barrel of a Malorian between a Troon's ribs, even if he is on your side. It's nothing personal. No hard feelings, I hope. Security measures, precautions. Thought the token would have done the job. Could be fake. Simply counterfeit. Counterfeiting a person is a lot harder. You're not in the biz, V. Al biz. <laughs> what gave me away? You got into a stranger's car. You're lucky I am who I claim to be. I combed FIA data for info about you. Interesting profile. Snowman. Back at clan. No longer extent. Now a freelance merc. To make things more interesting, FIA agent. You received a commission last night. One thing eludes me. What drove you to get entangled in this mess? Guess I'm still trying to wrap my head around it. Yeah, I feel you. I get tasked with correcting someone else's mistakes. I do my own rapping. Right. It's time we paid our friend in distress a visit. Address, please. Just, uh, FYI. Not so sure you're gonna like it. Try me. Abandoned building on Crest Street, 8th floor. Damn straight, I don't like it. You left her alone? In Dogtown? Was I supposed to drag her along while cruising around? Actually... Look, place seemed plenty safe to me. Safe? A derelict building in Dogtown. Just listen to how that sounds. Hold up. I need to take this. Why are you calling me on my day off? Last I heard, you're the manager. Ask Bob. He owes me a favor anyway. Yeah, well, tough nuts. You'd have to manage without me. Boss, man. 
I work the door of the club. Selection, you know, bouncing. FIA special agent, bouncing away time at a club. The job attracts ex-cops and commandos too. I know a few. They're a tough bunch. Trouble. Easy to blend in with over beers. This is not how I imagine spending my day off. Saving the president? Great action BD shit right there, am I right? Yeah, sure, I guess so. Does my eyes still smoke? I had a ciggy on a balcony this morning. Why you ask? When things start to spiral out of control, she's likely to light up. It's high time we help her out. So this is the place. Eighth floor. Yeah. Lead the way. Honestly, this is not inspiring confidence. Relax, she ain't alone. Made some new tunes, locals. Introductions were a little dicey, but she turned on the charm. Probably has her Dogtown campaign staff by now. This keeps getting worse and worse. If anyone had tried to extract her forcibly, this whole level would be in shambles. No way she would have gone quietly. Open up! It's me! Yeah, yeah, coming! Don't move, For fuck's sake! Again? Where is she? That's enough, gentlemen. Put your tools away, gents. Compare length and girth when I'm not around. You the boss. Are you sure? Look around. Positive. Hmm. You remembered my number. Some numbers you never forget. Never with me, Roslyn. You never intended to call that line. Well, I found myself in Night City with a bounty on my head. So it seemed the right moment to reach out, have a tete-a-tete, -tete, reset an old friendship. I'd offer to sit down and chat over coffee, but the clock's ticking. I need to arrange a passage for you to Washington. No, Reed. We need to talk first, all three of us. Come on, we should talk in private. The President, a merc, and a special agent walk into the Oval Office. Question is, where do I fit into this joke? You've seen the news. Uh-huh. Hanson's spin work never fails to amuse. 